scoreonair.com. We're down here today from the orange and brown scrimmage. Live here at OSU, Ohio Stadium. How do you think the Browns are going to do this season? Uh, well, I think they're starting over again, so it's going to be a little rough. I'm hoping for maybe 4-12, and 5-11, and 11, something along those lines. Agree. You like the move, the, the head coaching hire of Hugh Jackson. Yeah, I loved it. Uh, I like Hugh's energy. Hey, what do you think of Hugh Jackson? Is it a good hire? Are, are the Browns going in the right direction with that hire? Are you kidding me? I mean, I think that's the best thing that this team has done since they've came back. What are your impressions on Hugh Jackson so far, what he's done with the ball club? Uh, you know, I'm going to put his faith in him. You know, obviously he got he just got here. Um, I thought it was pretty interesting during rookie camp how he kind of called out some of the guys. And it's like, these guys aren't in shape. And it's like, Are you happy with the hiring of Hugh Jackson? Yes. Name a player or two that you see has, has stood out, maybe surprised you, that you've seen in training camp so far this season. Uh, I think the biggest standout from probably anybody would be Corey Coleman. That, that guy can just break open. Do you believe RG3 is going to have a, a big year? I'm a Browns fan. I always believe, man. How do you think RG3 is going to fit in with the Browns this year? Oh, RG3, I think like he, that's a great pickup for us. I feel like real explosive, real fast, great quarterback. Day one, the opening game of starter is going to be. RG3. RG3. What about Terrell Pryor, the former Buckeye? Hey, he can do what Josh Cribbs did back in the day. So, you know, he's a wildcat. Then you got Duke Johnson in the back. All I can say is watch out for our offense. How do you think the Browns will do this season? I mean, we've been saying it like almost every year that this is your year, our year, but like this year actually feels right. I feel like we actually gonna at least be over 500. At least be over 500. And we beating the Bengals too. High expectations, beating the Bengals. Sweep the Bengals. Sweeping the Bengals. What do you think the record is gonna be? Uh, I, I still think we got to get some time. I'm not going to get out of control and, you know, <laughs> say that we're going to the playoffs. Oh, put a number out there. <laughs> Let's say 8-8. Eight 8-8? Eight. Eight and eight? I yeah. agree with that. Yeah. What, do you think, what do you think reasonable expectations are for the year? I'm hoping at least 500. Doing so we're going to go ahead and get out of here. My name is Fred. We're signing off from Score On Air. Hey, this is Derek Owens, Jr., D.O. Jr., ScoreOnAir.com. Hey. Thanks. Terrell Woodard signing off, Brown and Orange scrimmage. Again, I'm Holly. Phil with scoreonair.com. Go Brown. Go Brown! Go Brown. Go Brown. Woo!